Do vitamins really help with male sexual function? Today we're talking about folic acid, also known as vitamin B9, and its surprising role in supporting erections, performance, and nitric oxide production in men. Folic acid is most commonly known for its role in pregnancy and fertility support for women. But research now shows that it may also play a key role in male sexual health, especially in how your body produces nitric oxide, the compound responsible for triggering and maintaining erections. Nitric oxide is a vasodilator. It relaxes the blood vessels and improves circulation. And that's what makes it critical during the erection process. Without enough nitric oxide, the blood flow to the penis can't reach the level needed for firmness and performance. A new study recently examined men with erectile dysfunction and measured their folic acid levels compared to men without any erection issues. The sample included nearly 1,000 men with ED and over 800 men without. Here's what they found. On average, men with erectile dysfunction had significantly lower levels of folic acid in their bloodstreams, up to 0.94 nanograms per milliliter less. And the more severe the dysfunction, the lower the folic acid levels dropped. Another group of men with ED was given 0.4 to 0.5 milligrams of folic acid daily for three months. These men saw measurable improvements in erection quality. In fact, some who were previously classified as having severe ED improved to moderate or even mild categories. There was also a subgroup of diabetic men studied. These men were split into two groups. Both received tadalafil every two days, but only one group received folic acid at a dose of 5 mg per day. The other group received a placebo. The group that received folic acid showed stronger, firmer, more reliable erections. That's a significant finding, especially considering the dose was higher than typically recommended, but still well within safe levels without any major side effects. So what can we take away from all of this? Should folic acid be prescribed for erectile dysfunction? Not yet. The evidence is promising, but not conclusive. There's still no consensus on the ideal dose, the best duration of treatment, or whether the effects are long-lasting or temporary. And more importantly, folic acid can interact with other medications, such as anticonvulsants. So it's not appropriate for everyone. That's why I don't recommend jumping straight to supplements at least not without a conversation with your healthcare provider. But here's what I do recommend. Eat more folate-rich foods. You'll get many of the same benefits naturally, and it's completely safe for most men. Some of the best sources of folate include leafy greens like spinach, cauliflower, and broccoli. Bananas, melons, oranges, and tomatoes are also great options. And if you're a meat eater, beef liver, kidney, and mushrooms are rich in natural folates. These foods don't just support erections, they support cardiovascular health, testosterone production, energy, and even mood. But none of that matters if your lifestyle is working against you. The most important thing you can do for your sexual health is maintain the basics. That means a clean, nutrient-dense diet, regular physical activity, sleep, managing your weight, and staying away from smoking or heavy alcohol use. Because no vitamin, on its own, can fix what years of inactivity or stress can do. If you found this information helpful, or if you know someone who could benefit from it, please share it. Subscribe to the channel for more science-backed guidance on male health, performance, and vitality. We release new content every week. And remember, when it comes to your sexual health, Knowledge is power, but action is everything. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video.